Yeah, good afternoon. Uh, this is the technical uh, press conference. Um, we have Coach Kim and uh, the press conference will be based to the Mage Tanzania Visas Benin, which will be played tomorrow at 4 p.m. Welcome, Coach. Habaria Mjana. It's nice to see all of you. It's great to see the high numbers. It shows that there is an interest in the Taifa Stars. And as I mentioned on the former press meeting, the only team who can unite the whole nation is the national team. We are now coming to the second part of our World Cup qualification round. Uh, for the first, uh, first part, as you know, we played away, we played home, and to everybody's surprise and happiness, we managed to be top of the table. Now we are going into the second round, back-to-back -back versus Benin. And the players and me, we have a dream. We have a dream to be on top of the table when we have finished the match against Benin. That's our dream, that's what we want to achieve. So, we know it can happen, because we have a strong belief in each other, in the team, and also the confidence after getting point in the first two games are growing, and we are playing at home. We will definitely miss our fans at home, because it could have been wonderful to have a full house at the National Stadium to support, but we all know that's not possible this time. So, very clear, we want to be on top of the table after we have played the first. Okay, so I just was corrected that we can have at least 10,000 spectators now. That is very good. We are very happy about, uh, about that. Uh, we started the camp for a few days ago. So we have two days of uh, preparation and we are going to have the final uh, session uh, today. Of course, when we now play Benin, we also have a close, we know the strengths of Benin and we know they are a strong team. 90% of the players from Benin are playing abroad, mainly in France, where they play League One or League Two. And we have seen for the first two games that they are a very uh, strong team. They had the same start line in the first game and the second game. Uh, so I think more or less they will, they will come with the more or less the same team uh, again. And we know they have some uh, players that are good in the strike force, they have good wing play, they also have a solid midfield. So we have respect for our opponent. That's always important in football, that you have respect 